Hello guys, Educated Collins here, and in this video, I want to respond to Trump's cyberbullying video. Now, something I have to keep in mind is to just not sound like a douche. It's easy to think about, but it's hard to pull off. So, I've been wanting to do this for a while, and if you haven't seen the video, it should be on the screen right now. And there should be also a link in the description. Uh, if you have not seen the video or you do not want to watch the whole thing, Trump talks about content creators, whether they are streamers or YouTubers, and how in the gaming community there are a lot of creators that he sees having to deal with a constant flow of negativity, not because they're bad people, not because they did something wrong, but either they're either popular, unique, or essentially a girl. I mean, it's crazy sometimes. He mentions that he does not want a century, essentially meaning not in his generation of time to pass before something changes and urges us as gaming creators and viewers to rise up to speak up and foster a change in our community all that is needed for the forces of evil to triumph is for enough good men and women to do nothing i dream one day of becoming this good man you know it's a life goal of mine so i shall start here by offering my thoughts on this matter i also urge a lot of content creators to do the same Many content creators do not realize just how impactful they are to the society at the moment. Content creators may very well be the teachers of the new generation. A lot of young men, a lot of young women, they watch videos and games and they give a lot of respect to the pros and entertainers in multimedia. Speaking up and sharing your story will affect someone. Even if it's only a few people that truly understand the message about helping foster a better community, whether it's for gaming or elsewhere, it is a real lasting impact. The key is to spread the message in a way that encourages others to do the same. You may reach 10, but those 10 can reach 100, those 100 can reach 1,000, so on, so on. It all builds upon itself to actually see change. So I have points of my own, but a response is when you actually talk about his points, not just use the video's name as promotion. And that just seems silly, really. So he lists two points. Um, content creators are real people and that you can counter negativity with positive ones so point number one when you post something on Twitch or YouTube realize that we are actually real people see like you can touch me I'm, I'm a real person with feelings and thoughts and a lot of us actually read most of the YouTube comments and the Twitch messages at least, I mean a lot of the good ones and the copy pasta and we learn through time and experience to ignore um, some of it but it still affects us everyone like i can't think anyone that is just a buddha at this and mastery of all um negativity blockage um like a mighty river cuts through a, a rock through persistence a hateful message can infect either, even the kindest of souls so if you're saying something or you see something negative just let them know that it's not something that is appreciated in that in this community um, however, don't be a dick about it. Do not, do not, do not be a dick about it. If you attack them, then you've lost the argument. Um, the game's over. You're, you're just going to foster negativity by attacking people. Um, speak in a calm, rational manner, or type, right? <laughs> in a calm, rational manner. I try to forget that, you know, you type in, in, uh, in the internet. Um, try to educate them, not attack them. I believe that per knowledge is a person's greatest weapon. And if you can give them some of that knowledge, um, then you, each of every, each and every one of us, we can make a real change in this world. You just have to, you affect one, you know, it builds on itself. And his number, his second point is you can turn something on its head. Copy pastas do not have to be a negative, do not have to have a negative connotation. You, do you remember anything someone has ever done in this world to make your day better? Right? It this is fifty times greater for streamers like or people in the spotlight. A lot of them they get their joy, they get their um what makes them happy. It the being able to do what they love for sure is one of the things. But a lot of things is seeing the actual real impact they have on society to see someone they get better to make someone happier day by day that really keeps people going keeps um, driving them keeps keeping it lets them stay happy stay committed stay it really helps is what I'm trying to say and digging through all the spotlight all the messages all the, and finding the ones that are really positive it just makes 
anyone's day really if you truly want to res affect a streamer send them a thoughtful message say something like hey trump i really respect you i like what you're doing with the gaming community keep it up i'm very supportive of what you're doing and i have a little money so you know i've subscribed or something and i'm following your life you know if you ever need anything let me know i hope you're having a great day man something like that just anything any message like that goes a long way even for the biggest content recruiters it doesn't matter how big they are just let them know that you appreciate what they're doing. All their hard work actually affects you positive. It's really beautiful when they get that message, period. Try it out. Uh, make an experiment. Every time you you get on a stream or you watch a YouTube video and you appreciate, you, you just appreciate what they're doing, just say something nice. Be genuine. You have to be genuine. And see the results. It's, it's a really good point by Trump. And it's something I hope people start actually doing. It will, I hope, it, it will do something. And I also want to mention, this may seem unrealistic to some of you right now. Remember, there's a key to this. There's a key to that. all madness. People, if it's interesting, unique, there's probably a reason. And just keep that in mind. The key is that you're never alone. Like, think of all the great world changers in this world. Mother Teresa, Martin Luther King, Abraham Lincoln, Nelson Mandela. I'm from the U.S., obviously. Um, people like that. They may be the... Um, the figureheads, the the people you think that you think to to remember, but it would be ignorant, really, truthfully, to think that anyone who's done anything in this world did it by themselves. Um, there are people around. I know, especially when you're young, that it seems like everyone doesn't really care. But the world, I hope, people are slowly changing. People are slowly learning. The world is moving to, uh, hopefully, a better place. And just remember. If you change others, if you change yourself, others can change as well, right? If you thought, oh, you know, I've always been like this. But if you just think, oh, you know, he's, this is a good point. You know, I don't have to say these copy passes. I can actually turn it around. Just realize no matter how young you are, you can affect someone else. And it doesn't take a miracle. It just takes people that care. And that's pretty much my response to this video. It's... Um, I have an audience now, so I thought it's something I should do because I've always wanted to um, respond, but I didn't really have the opportunity or the time. Now I do, so I want to do that today. And major respects to Trump for creating this video, and I'd love, to, I'd like to say that more videos like this should be in the world, right? It lets people think about their actions, and it also changes opinions. I'll start to do more videos um, of this nature as well, and. You know, I don't want to be remembered as some dude who just plays games. I want to be a dude that plays games that actually cares. And But that's hard to achieve, right? Actions over words. Um, so hopefully you guys appreciate um, the message. And I'll see everyone later. And have a great day, humans. Roll clip. <laughs> oh, man. So I say, screw waiting for a century. We can change the world, too.